Well, this past weekend, we crowned the 2019 MTN 8 winners. Congratulations to Supersport United, Matatanta Apitori, for beating Highlands Park to walk away with that coveted title. We are joined in studio by Opri Muriba and, of course, the winning coach, Kaitanu Tembo. Very warm welcome to you, Thank you very much for having us. <laughs> coach, let me start with you. Um, after what happened last year in the penalties, was the game plan to wrap the game in 90 minutes? Yeah, well, I think uh, we always want to try and wrap it in 90 minutes because yep. penalties, <laughs> you have other attacks with penalties, but at the same time, I think uh, credit goes to the, to the players. I think uh, uh, they did very well. Uh, they, they deserve all the credit and uh, I think it wasn't an uh, easy game. It was a very difficult game because we were playing also against a very good team. Yep. Mm. Aubrey, how was the journey, my brother? How was the journey of the MTN8 whole tournament? Yeah, the journey was tough, eh? I yeah. wouldn't lie, man. Uh, we played uh, Vets, the first game. Yeah. Yeah, we managed to beat them 3-0 sure. on a tough one against our 20 rivals, Mami Louis Sundowns. Sure. Yeah, our first leg, we drew 1-1. One -one. Yeah. They had an advantage with our goal. But yeah, that didn't stop us, you know, you know, to prepare for the second leg. And we managed to beat them 2-0. And yeah, it was a tough one, I don't yeah. want to lie. Yeah. You guys are cup specialists. How different was this final? Uh, this one, I think, was different because Highlands Park, you know, it was their first time in the final. You know, I think they, they really wanted to win it so that they can show something because mm. yeah. I think they started well this season. So I think, yeah, it was different from the other finals because last season we played Cape Town City because we played them before uh, Telcom yep. knockout uh, final. So I think they, 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 they got experience in terms of that. But this one was different because Highlands Park was their first time in the final. Coach, what's your secret? How do you keep these young men motivated, especially before a big game such as the finals? And how do you keep them with the hope with eyes? We are now your lady. Yeah, well, I think uh, uh, we've got a structure. Mm -hmm. And uh, that uh, structure and the culture is built, you know, not uh, game by day game. It's also built throughout the season. I think sure. uh, we've had a very good preseason uh, to build on the players, you know, mentally. Uh, and also work on them, you know, tactically, technically. And uh, we, I've got a very, you know, good bunch of players uh, who are disciplined. Yeah. Uh, and also, good, you know, very committed, you know, support mm. staff as well. So it's easy, it's not just about me. You know, yeah. we've got a lot of people also looking after the players as well, so yeah. it's very key. Yeah, it was your first um, trophy, Coach. Just talk us through the emotions you were going through on First Saturday. of many for Super Sport, we know <laughs> that there's more yeah. coming. <laughs> Yeah, well, I think uh, it was emotional, and I think mm. uh, especially after losing the first one. Yep. Uh, the last one, I thought uh, I could go and we could go and win it. Uh, but this one, uh, I think we came a little bit wiser now, you know, as a team, you know, because uh, we're playing a, a team which we knew that they're going to be very emotional in their approach because first final, you know, after a very long time. Mm. So we needed to be a little bit more wiser and uh, use our experience, you know, very well. And I think we did that and we managed the game very well. Yeah. yeah. Opry, Benji, what are the plans now for the rest of the league? Uh, uh, when are the celebrations going to end? <laughs> when are we going to get back to the field? Because I can see coaches like, hey, please. <laughs> I uh, know, I think uh, we'll be done with the celebrations. Okay. Already? <laughs> <laughs> That's what I can. Yeah, yeah, no, yeah. we need to focus in the league and yeah. there's Telcom coming. Um, we need to put uh, this one behind us and focus on, like, on the league and the, the, the Telcom knockout because we want to keep, you know, that consistency, you know, going forward, you know, yeah. so that we can do well as well in the league. Oh, definitely. Coach Aubrey, thank you all so much. Uh, congratulations once again. Uh, celebrate, Gagdad, but not too long. <laughs> <laughs> celebrate, Gagdad. No, we'll take stock at the end of the season. There's still a lot of football to play. Mm. Uh, so for now, we put in the bag.